Now to counter that in yoga, ooh, oh, wow, got, feeling a little dizzy, yeah. no, that. So just, just for that, to counter that, we're gonna do a forward fold. You ready for that? Yep. Okay, no. this time, no. bring your legs out as far as they will go. Now you're very tall, James, so you wanna stay nice and far. Put your brakes on, Keep bo make sure both your feet are turned in, very good. Inhale, bring your arms up to shoulder height, palms facing down, keep inhaling, take your arms all the way overhead, palms facing in. Now once you're in this position, what we're going to do, and before you actually do it, I'm going to just tell you what, what to expect. We're going to exhale and fold from the hip. Keep your back nice and straight. Keep exhaling till your palms touch the ground. Keep your back straight and exhale and fold. Place your palms between your legs. Make sure your elbows are close together. And once you're nice and secure, if you want, you can take your feet further apart, but whatever you do, make sure your brakes are on. Make sure your feet are turned in. Now, if you're feeling very ambitious today, you may want to reach for the floor, but if you cannot, that's fine. Now, you, if you don't touch the floor with your forehead, that's perfectly all right. You should still feel a beautiful, beautiful stretch in your hamstrings. Now, as we try to come up, you may want to wiggle your feet closer just a little bit. Once you feel nice and secure, bring your palms together, bring your hands out in front of you, keep your back nice and straight, inhale and come up. Very nice. Exhale and release. Now wiggle your feet closer till you feel it safe. Now bring your feet closer, bring your legs closer. We're gonna, ooh. <laughs> Sorry, that's you okay? Quite bad. Yeah, yeah. Well, you probably needed that stretch after sitting in those cars. Tell me, how, right. did, how did it feel sitting in these cars? These must be fabulous cars, but they must be very low. You're a big guy. No, no, it's quite spacious, but it I is. do spend too much time sitting in cars. I'm not going to deny it. I haven't well, done that's any good. I'm glad you're here. Let's turn to face the front. Turn to the front of the mat. Once again, I'm going to stagger myself. Heels are together, toes slightly apart. We're going to inhale, take our arms all the way overhead. Your friends are missing out. Can I just say, sure. yeah, sorry, could yeah. I just ask? No, no. Can the other two come and Absolutely. join in? Absolutely, they're they welcome to come any time. We're waiting for them. Where are the other two? Come on, Jeremy. This one. What? Jeremy, sorry. Well, why aren't they joining in? I think they should. Yeah. Tell it's them good. how you feel. Maybe that's right. Tell them how much inner peace I've achieved in just 10 minutes. <laughs> I think they're terrified I'm going to get them in knots and they won't be able to. It hurts there. It hurts because of the back bend. You're nice and tight. And as long as you keep your muscles tight, you'll, it'll be temporary. You will feel fine. At the end of this, you should feel great. I've never been very flexible, even when I was a small No, you don't. Child. This program is about making you feel more flexible. You'll be fine. Yeah. We're waiting. While well, we're waiting for you guys, let's just relax and get into the next stretch. As what very nice, cool hands Okay, you let's have. keep going. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, nice. Now, keep our heels to, Let's keep our heels together. Toes are slightly apart. Inhale. Take your arms up to shoulder height. Palms facing down. Keep inhaling. Take your arms <coughs> all the way overhead. You feeling okay, James? Yeah, yeah. Okay, palms are clasped together. Now, what we're going to do, we're going to dip our torso to the left and to the right as we exhale. Exhale, dip to the left. Inhale, let's come up. Exhale, to the right. Inhale, let's come up. And exhale, bring your arms in front of your chest, palms facing down, elbows are nice and up. Very nice. The previous posture, this previous stretch was just to feel a beautiful stretch in your obliques. This sequence is intended to stretch you everywhere. So, palms, elbows are nice and up, palms facing down. Keep your feet about six to eight inches apart. And what we're going to do is we're going to exhale to the right and to the left. And when we exhale, we're going to take one arm out. See how far back you can go without moving your hips. And as we exhale to the left, we're going to do the same. And then we'll do it one more time taking our hips with us and notice the difference. And you'll find this very useful if you play, do you play golf? No, I'm afraid not. Well, after this, you might want to because you have a lot of hip it. movement. <laughs> okay, let's exhale to the right. Swing your right arm out. Look back at the right arm, wherever it takes you. Just look back. Inhale, bring your right arm back in. Exhale to the left. Very nice control motion. Inhale to the front. This time, we're going to do it one more time. This time, take your hips with you and feel how your arms will go all the way back, much further. Exhale to the right. Very nice. Take your hips. See? There you go. Inhale. Let's come forward. Exhale to the left. 
Inhale, come forward, exhale, and relax. James, quick question before we do a few balancing stretches. Are you okay for balance? Oh, well, I don't fall over very often. You don't? No, and I can That's ride a bicycle, so. Okay, let's try a couple of those, and let's see how we go with that. Transfer <coughs> the weight of your body. <coughs> I'm so sorry. Would you like to have some water? Are you no, sure? No, it's fine. Okay. Transfer your body weight onto your right leg. Lift your left leg, uh, lift the heel of your left foot, and move physically with your hand. Move your left knee to the side. Very good. Now, what we're going to do is place, we're going to attach the sole of the left foot to your inner right thigh. Let's try that. Not permanently. No, not permanently. Very, very temporary. Maybe a few seconds. Let's take the left leg up. Hold the left ankle with your hand, with your left hand. Place your right hand, if you wish, right hand, the other hand. Oh, so I'm doing it. Yes. Right. Okay. That's it. Very nice. Oh, that's Place your right hand on your right hip for balance and attach the sole of your left foot to your inner right thigh. Wait. Okay, exhale and release. Very <laughs> gently. That's okay. That, it's perfectly all right to fall out of a position as long as you don't give up. You come right back in. Let's try the other leg now. Transfer the weight to your left leg. So you're nice and steady on the left leg. We are going to inhale. First, raise the right foot. Raise, yes, very nice. Turn your right knee out. Place your left hand on your left hip. Inhale, hold on to your right ankle and very gently place your right foot nice and firm on the inner left thigh and hold. It's very difficult. It's okay. No, that's all right. We won't do too many balances. Exhale and release. That's perfectly all right. When you did bring it up, what I prob and maybe we could try it one more time. This time I'll give you a little warning. When you're doing a balanced posture, Look at a position in front of you that doesn't move. Don't look at people. So look at your shoes. No, yes, at the mic. Anything the that doesn't move. Any one okay. object. You want to try that again? Give it a shot. You were very good. So it's yeah. push knee out, and then... Push the knee out. Very good. And okay. I inhale and lift my foot. Inhale, hold on to your right ankle, and place your okay, right here we foot. Go. Good. Very nice. No, not quite. That's all right. Let's I try another... Ba you don't want to give up, so I know you want to try another balanced posture. This time, look at, let's say, look at your shoes. Okay. Do they inspire you <laughs> to stay still? Yeah. No, okay, you want to look at the I mic like there. The carpet, yeah. Okay, the carpet, any one spot on the carpet. Perfect. There. Okay, look right there. Let's try another balanced posture. We're going to take, hold on to our left ankle from behind. Place your right hand on your hip for balance. Hold on to your left ankle from behind. When you're ready, you're very steady. Good. See, the focus has helped a lot already. Inhale. See if you can let go of your right arm. Inhale your right arm all the way up. Very nice. And hold. James, your balance is already improving. That's fabulous. Exhale and release. Very gently. Very slow, controlled motions. Release your leg. <coughs> Excuse me. The weather must be pretty dry out there. It's actually also quite cold over here because of the equipment, so. Yeah. But I yeah, appreciate okay. you saying that. Okay, now transfer the weight to your left leg. And what we're going to do is hold on. Place your left hand on your left hip. Hold on to your left ankle from behind. Look at a spot in front of you that doesn't move. Now, hold. If you're feeling steady. I'm not so good on the left as I was on the right. Right. That's another thing. We all find out our imbalances, and it's good to acknowledge that. You find you're more flexible on one side as well. Inhale your left arm up. That's fine. If you want to go to the side, that's good. Exhale and release. You did very well. You're right. right. I, I think the balance is great. Uh, much better on the other side. It all comes with focus and practice. So keep coming here. Keep driving in here. And bring it's your friends with you. <laughs> it is a long way. Anytime you're here, you're welcome. We shoot quite often. I think Mr. Hammond would be very good at this because <coughs> he's quite into keep fit. Where is he? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why he's just camera shy, maybe. Is he? Yeah, he's, probably, yeah, he's very definitely camera shy. <laughs> do you want to keep going or shall I? I would love to know a little more about your car. So let's do a few more stretches and then we'd, we'd okay. like to talk about your cars. You're happy to keep going? Yeah. How about you, Claudia and Vikram? You're okay? All right. Now, once again, heels are together, toes are slightly apart. This time we're going to transition four postures, one after the other. It's going to be very graceful, very slow, very controlled. 
which is going to transition, and I'll talk you through it, so it's not a problem. Inhale, bring your arms up to shoulder height, palms facing down. Keep inhaling, take your arms all the way overhead, palms facing in. This time, clasp your opposite elbows. Very nice. Now, once you've clasped them, bring your elbows back as far back as you can. Bring your shoulders back. We're going to exhale and fold from the hip. Keep your back nice and straight. Exhale and fold. You'll find that as you keep exhaling, you will go deeper and deeper, and all you want is one millimeter every day. You want to feel the depth of the stretch. Just go deeper one millimeter every day. You're not going to measure that, but you're going to feel it. Keep exhaling. Now, very gently, unclasp your hands. Place your palms on the floor about 16 inches in front of your feet. Then, when your palms are nice and flat, take the left foot back. Palms on the floor, good. And then take the right foot back. And we're already in mountain posture. And dip your head between your hands. So you should feel a beautiful hamstring stretch. If you feel your heels are not, I, please stay there. This is also good rest posture. If you feel your heels are not touching the ground today, you want to make the connection, you can place your foot on the brick. That's good. Claudia. OK. Now, right from this position, you're already in mountain position. We're going to take our left foot forward. Now, if your foot doesn't come all the way in the first shot, just use your hands and bring them forward. And dip your pelvis, dip your hip. Very gently, place your left knee on the floor, uncurl your toe, uh, your right knee on the floor, uncurl your toes. And let's come back just a little bit. I place. Sorry, you're feeling that stretch. No, my jeans are giving me a slight problem uh, in the gentleman's room. I should say, you're very sporting. You're stretching in jeans, yeah. so yeah. good for you. Well, I've gone quite faint as well. Careful. Okay, okay. And this is the last posture, and then we want to talk to you and ask you a little bit about your driving. You okay? Inhale, raise the right arm. Exhale, dip your right elbow over your left knee. Place the left palm over the right palm the other side. That's good. Left palm over the right palm, and look up at your left elbow. Inhale, release the posture. We're going to switch legs to the other side. We're going to get right back, and then we're done. Now, let's go back into the mountain posture. Place your palms on the floor. Take both your legs back. And this time, we're going to inhale. Bring the right foot forward between the hands. Bring your right foot forward. Once you have both your palms nice and secure, place your left knee on the floor. Uncurl your left, the toes on your left foot. And then come back just a little bit. Inhale. Raise the left arm. Exhale. Dip the left elbow over the right knee. Place the right palm over the left palm. Look up at your right elbow. So you want to look. That's it. Very nice. Inhale. Release. Let's untangle ourselves. Let's all sit down. And now we are ready to hear a little more about your journey 